So you want to import products from Shane into your Shopify. I'm going to show you how to do this in a very easy way. The very first thing you want to do is to set up your Shopify store. I'm going to leave you a link down below in the description just in case you haven't claimed a Shopify store and having an actual great deal to get started in. So now that you have just created your Shopify, you might be seeing that we have the actual dashboard. Now, what I wanted to do is to go here into Shane.com. Here into this application, what I need to do is to look out and check out all the products that I would like to add directly into Shopify. So I usually just choose an actual niche. It's going to be much more faster to check out all the prices that I can focus on. The, let's say, footwear, speaking about footwear, bikini, um, I don't know, maybe just focus into just one uh, element there. Once you have just checked out the product which you'd like to sell, it's time to add those directly into Shopify. And for that, what you wanted to do is to set up and install a dropshipping application. So we need to install the dropshipping app that supports the actual Shane products. We recommend you using the Deezus application, which is actually really popular for user-friendly. Now there are a lot of dropshipping applications that can help you to add products directly from Shane. So if I go directly into applications, I just type the word dropshipping, or even you can just type the word Shane and go for searched into the Shopify app store. This one should be taking you into this new section of the app store and you can see that there's a lot of applications that we can use for importing products directly into your store. As you can see, we have this Shane Clothing Dropshipping DS. So you can find and pull and sell fashion dropshipping products. We actually are not using this a lot. But if you still are interested in to look out for products that you can try with more, for example, these is look out for the best one that suits for you. Just make sure that here comes for the complete plan and there's uh, not basic plans and we don't want to pay extra for that. Now let's install the application. This is the part which you wanted to search directly into the following prompts to install the application and connect the chain directly into these. So as you can see, we are inside the dropshipper supplier. Here, what we can do is to search for products. If you have already found one product that you'd like to add directly into the store, let's go back into Shane. Copy the product name and paste it here into the dropshipper supplier to see if this one is available to add it into your store. If it's not available, you don't have to worry. What you can do is to try it out and look out for more lookalike products that you can add directly into the store. So let's assume, for example, that I would like to add this product and I go for add to the import list. So once you hit into add to the import list, you should see that these actual elements should be added into the import list section. Inside the input list, what you wanted to do is just to look out for an actual new element. When you choose a product and choose to add it into the input list, you should see that here it should be appearing into the left part. Into the left part, what you can do is to look out for your store. Go for input list, and here you should see that you're going to be appearing all your input list added. So once you have added all of those elements, what you can do is now to hit into add it automatically and all those elements, for example, the title, the description, absolutely everything should be added automatically here inside Shopify. Now, if you ask me AliExpress, Shane, and so much more website online store works as the actual new section, which is drop shipping. So that means that you're going to be trying to do some drop shipping inside of a drop shipping store. So what I can totally recommend you is to look out for an application to come helping you to do drop shipping and not going directly into Shane. So, for example, in our case, we're actually using CJ Dropshipping, which is going to be much more faster to use, much more easier, and it even comes with a lot of products that you can add directly inside the store. So, once you have chose the right product for you, the right application for you, the best solution for you is to choose one product from uh, Shane and try to find that product directly into the Dropshipping store section or just one look and like product, you can see how it should be, let's say, added directly into the store. So if you hit now into list, for example, you can list look out for the section that says list, go into the store products, and here what you can do is to edit the product title, the store selection, the bundle, the collections, you can change the variant pricings. For example, here what I can do is to this price costs $20, so what I can do is to do this a little bit much more higher so I can add it directly into my store. Hit into list now, and it might be taking just a few seconds to add this directly into your store. 
lastly what you need to do is to go back directly inside my Shopify look out for products reload the page and make sure that my product is now being added automatically inside all the products that I have just added you can click into the option that says view into online store so you can see that all these elements should be let's say added automatically for example the title the description the product features the images and even the variant section and it actually looks really great guys so as you can see it's not that hard to get started by using and importing stuff from Shane directly into Shopify it was a really easy tutorial guys so with that being said we can now reach into the very end of the video but don't forget to give us a thumbs up subscribe to our channel and share this video stay tuned to the only media for more valuable tips and tutorials until next time